Each new draft season brings a bevy of standouts from smaller programs, and this year one of the most notable is Connecticut guard Christian Haynes. And we'll dig into just what traits made him stand out on this two-minute drill. Christian Haynes profiles as a road grader. His initial punch at the point of attack is destructive, popping defenders' pads and allowing him to take full control with leverage and his powerful grip. Haynes is on the shorter side for a guard, and this combined with his excellent length and stout frame make it easy for him to stay under forward rushes, hop his feet back, and re-anchor to slow them down. While he has a mean streak, Haynes also plays with a great deal of intelligence, quickly processing and adapting to defenders to finish them off in a variety of ways depending on the situation. It's rare to see Haynes take an improper angle, and once square, he has the flexibility to turn defenders and reroute them out of the play. While not an excellent mover, he maintains the foot speed to block on the move and pull, keeping his head up and ensuring he finds someone to occupy in clearing lanes. Haynes could also find his way to center, though this transition would likely take some time as he learns the nuances of the position. Haynes' biggest issues come at the beginning of plays. His feet and hands can be sluggish to start. This can cause his hands to land too far outside needing adjustment, while slow starting with his feet causes him to give up too much ground to defenders, catching them with his chest. Sluggish compartmentalized motions in his lower body can also hinder his timing on pulls. Haynes' aggressive nature as a blocker can also be a detriment to him. He has a tendency to lean and lunge, letting defenders get to his side. His finisher mentality can also get in his way, with him clinging to defenders a little too long or moving them in the way of developing plays. His average reactive speed could also hinder a jump to center as the position can require a speedier set of hands. My comparison for Haynes is Broncos guard Quinn Miners. Making the jump from Division 3, Miners adapted quickly to the increased level of competition, showcasing great point of attack blocking and grip strength thanks to his past as a wrestler. Though like Haynes, he has had to pick up his pace and lose some of his overly aggressive tendencies. While Miners was a little more athletic, I think they share a great deal of strengths and weaknesses. UConn used a wide zone blocking scheme, so teams like the 49ers would make the easiest jump for Haynes in the NFL, but he'll likely take a bit of time to adapt anyway so any team could be a fit. As of now, pre-combine, I think Haynes will likely go in the third round, but provided he tests well, I could see him landing firmly in the second round conversation. And that's the two-minute drill.